Hi and welcome to um, some tips and tricks using Clip Studio Paint. Hi, my name is Luis Escobar. I'm a storyboard artist on The Simpsons Television Show. I've been working on the show for over 25 years now and I'm here to empower you. So uh, today I'm going to be uh, speed drawing or creating an image. And uh, I, I, uh, I've recently just become aware of some really interesting uh, uh, ways of using Clip Studio Paint that I hadn't used before. So. Uh, one of the things that I did was I, I recorded myself doing this image because I knew that I was going to be using these kind of weird new things. And um, so I'm, I'm going to I'm going to highlight what I like about using these tools so that you could understand uh, what I'm doing, what I liked about them and why I found them useful. So um, and um, this is going to be uh, like kind of an, a religious image that I was working on. So maybe I might get into what the intent of this image was. Maybe not. I don't know. I I'll see. But otherwise, um, hopefully you'll get a lot out of the tips and tricks uh, that I used in order to make this image work. Um, all right. So without any further ado, here we go. All right, so uh, this image ended up taking me about eight hours to do. Um, as you can see, I'm kind of pulling stuff in. I have my grid here. I brought in a, a drawing that I did of my my wife here. So this is one of the things, uh, and and I'm and I'm kind of creating a bit of a uh, of a of a composition here with um, with some uh, you know some 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 shapes. This is supposed to be my wife, by the way. This is this is a drawing right here of of my wife. I wanted to put her in there. I usually, uh, when I draw pretty ladies, I just create a new pretty lady. But then I'm like, well, I'm married to a pretty lady. I might as well use my wife here as the pretty lady. All right. Um, so one of the tools that I uh, I never ever use, and I'm starting to use here is uh, the ruler tool that mirrors both sides. So here is the mirror tool. But also, this is the thing. This is the thing that blows my mind. This is the thing that I that really, I, I absolutely love. So there is a, a tool in, in Clip Studio Paint that, uh, that is overall, so I, here, here it is, here I'm gonna just show you. And then I'm, okay, so, uh, when you press it, what it does is what, whatever you create, like a like a like a flat graphic shape. What it does is it creates an outline around it. It just makes a line around it automatically. And uh, this just say so. I, I did this to the to the shrubbery. I did this to the trees. I did. It just makes it so much easier when when you're making shapes and you're trying to do something graphic. And even when, look, look, like I'm, I'm painting my wife's skin in here and it's automatically giving it an outline and I didn't even have to ink it. And that to me um, is, is, is amazing. Like I, I made these trees just through shapes and then, and then the, the outline just kind of appears. Um, I didn't do a, a, an actual line on any of this stuff. Look, you could see that it's already got, has an outline. So if you want to use this tool, this is the tool right here you press you press the one uh, up here on the left and then um and then what i do is then i uh the, usually the 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 graphic tool that i use here to to change the color of of layers uh is really handy too so i use that and my gosh it just speeds up everything and then of course i did regular normal everyday lines on everything but notice the big thick line even as i adjust the shape um, the uh, the outline of the of the drawing uh, moves around and changes around. Um, that was a huge it's a huge deal a huge deal I tell you it make it makes everything um, so much more um, it, it just makes it, it gives me a different effect like uh, uh, if I hadn't had that that uh, that uh, that tool if I hadn't become aware of that tool it would this would have taken me longer I would have had to like. Um, outline everything I would have to select it and then expand and then outline the thing it just it would have been so much more difficult it would have been so, a bigger pain in the neck um, so I, I highly recommend using the this tool uh, because then you can do what I'm doing here is just add textures inside um, and 
and it, it just it just it changes everything it changes it, it changes the way i approach doing any of the drawings and um and the best thing about it is that you could even change the color of the uh, the outline from black to white to whatever other color you want um i think i actually um uh, I do that a little bit in a few places. I I, I even changed the outline of, uh, on 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 my wife, uh, the figure of my wife, uh, and uh, see. But you can see it. You can see right here that I'm doing this tree here, and then you can see that there's a white outline on everything already, and then, so the white outline is already there. It, it just makes it so much easier when you when you do that sort of thing. Uh, the one time I didn't do that, I didn't turn on that level is in this painting here of this face. I didn't actually use that. I I, I um I, I kept it there and and I, I just kind of uh, had the the pencil line uh, that I that I brought in and and I just kept it that way. That was this was the only f image that I kind of didn't use the that little that little gimmick on. Uh, but uh, for the rest of it, I um. I absolutely used that that uh, that uh, that tool. Um, so uh, that that to me uh, it makes it makes a big deal. So the the combination of using the ruler tool that does the the symmetry and this new other tool that does see here's the symmetry tool um, that uh, it, uh, it it changes everything. It just makes all the textures makes everything just absolutely work. Um, so I'm, I'm really happy with the way this turned out. Like I said, it was an eight hour drawing here. I'm just doing it in about five minutes. But, um, but this, that, th that's my tip. My, my tip is, um, is the mirror tool and this, uh, the, that, the outline tool that I just showed you, uh, use it. It's great.